See, these are the announcements we have for the week of um, May 10th, Sunday, May 10th. And it's very feels very weird, but today is Mother's Day, or Sunday is Mother's Day. And um, it's good to celebrate mothers. It is, but it's also good to remember that it is not always an easy day. And it's important for us to stop and acknowledge the people who have been like mothers for us. Perhaps they are not themselves mothers, but they have taken care of us as mothers do. So take some time in the next few days to remember those who have cared for you as a mother does. Include those folks who are formally, formally not moms, but they still need to know that their care and their love matters, that their mothering is not forgotten. I remember in the years after my mom's mom died, it was very hard for my mom to go to church. So we rarely would go uh, to go to church on Mother's Day. So we rarely would go to worship on Mother's Day because mom just couldn't do it. So we would find another way to worship and another way to honor the love that grandma showed to all of us, to my mom and to us grandchildren. So I encourage you to take some time to honor your moms, honor those who have been like mothers to you. Let them know they are remembered. And similarly, please continue to reach out to one another, to encourage one another to remember you are not alone God gathers us into community. We are called together, brought together by God. It can be easy to forget that. So I encourage you to remember and to take time to reach out to one another. As Jesus said to Peter, tend the sheep that God has put in your care. Take care of those sheep. Lastly, just a reminder to continue to support Bread of Life with your financial gifts, with your money. God is at work among us and in the world. God is working through us. And just like God gave Peter to work to do in this week's gospel lesson, God also gives us work to do. And together we do that work through Bread of Life. So please continue to share your financial resources with Bread of Life. And the last thing in our announcements is that the gospel lesson on Sunday will be from the Gospel of John, chapter 21, verses 14 through 19. And then I added on just a little bit at the end of chapter 20. So it's chapter 20, verses 30 and 31. So God bless you in this week. God take care of you and you take care of one another. <laughs>